Hi, my name is Arnel Custodio and welcome to another InMotion Hosting WordPress video tutorial. Today we're going to be talking about how to embed a PDF file in a post. WordPress allows you to add documents of all types into their posts, but one of the most universal types of files that can be used is the PDF, which is called the Portable Document Format. PDF files allow you to develop content on multiple platforms then display them through a browser or reader application on different types of devices. We will be demonstrating how to embed a PDF into a WordPress post and show the difference when using a plugin like the Google Doc Embedder. Before you start, make sure that you have a few PDF files saved into your media library. If you have already loaded the Google Doc Embedder plugin, then deactivate it for the first part of the tutorial. There is a difference in embedding with a plugin like the Google Doc Embedder and using the default WordPress option to embed a PDF file. The default behavior without the plugin simply adds a link into the post going to the PDF file. In order for a viewer to see the PDF, they must click on the link. Using the Google Doc Embedder, you see the actual file immediately without having to click on the link. So let's go through the process of embedding a PDF into a WordPress post without using a plugin. If you have already loaded the Google Doc Embedder plugin, make sure that you go into the plugins and deactivate the plugin before starting this part of the tutorial. So here we're in the dashboard already, logged in as an administrator, and we're going to go ahead and go to posts. I'm going to go ahead and click on add new as we're adding a new post. And just go to this, call this a test post. And at this point, I'm going to go ahead and immediately add the PDF file. Then you click on Add Media. If you don't have a, a PDF file already loaded, you can click on Upload Files. Or if you have one loaded, then you should be able to find it within the media library. And I have one here at the beginning. At the bottom right hand corner, you want to click on Insert into Post. And then you'll see the text added if you're in the text tab. If you go to the visual side, you'll see the link. Click on Save Draft or Publish in order to save your post. In order to see the post as you would see it when you're viewing it in the live site, click on Preview Changes. And here you can see the post and you can see the link to the PDF file, which is the default way that WordPress handles a PDF file. In order to see the actual PDF file, you would have to click on the link. So we're going to go ahead and embed a PDF into a WordPress post using the Google Doc Embedder plugin. If you haven't loaded it already, you can always go back into the WordPress.org site and click on Plugins, and then search for Google Doc Embedder. Note that there are different plugins that can do the same thing. We have no preference for the plugin that you wish to use. So here I'm logged in to the WordPress Administrator dashboard. I'm going to go ahead and go back to posts and I'm going to head and edit the test post that we were editing previously and you can see the link from the previous option here so I'm going to go back down a few lines and then I'm going to click on add media I'm going to click on the same PDF file that I had before and this time we have the plugin enabled and notice that there's nothing different here. It's all the same um, interface. And all you're doing, again, is clicking on Insert into Post at the bottom right-hand corner. Now, when you look at the post, and this is in the Visual tab, you'll see that it, it's giving you short code for the file that you're actually loading. Click on Update to update the file. And now when you click on Preview Changes to view the post, you'll see the link from the first time you added the PDF file and then you'll see the graphic representation of the PDF file using the plugin. Notice that the option for the plugin allows you to view the file and it also allows you to download the file. So it gives you a link at the bottom allowing you to download the file. And that concludes our tutorial on how to embed PDF files into a WordPress post using either the default options or using a plugin like the Google Doc Embedder. Thanks for watching this video tutorial. We hope you enjoyed it. 
If you could, please give us a thumbs up below and also subscribe to our channel. Also, please leave a comment so that we would know what kind of videos you'd like to see in the future. Thanks again for watching and have a great day. Do you know the InMotion Hosting Support Center has thousands of articles, pictures, and video tutorials to help you out with your web hosting questions? Something for everyone, from beginners to experts. Join our community and sign up with your Facebook or Google Plus for free swag, prizes, and discounts. Visit our support center at InMotionHosting.com support.